Hi guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be sharing a super fun video. I'm going to be organizing my closet, like home edit edition. I teased about doing this on my Instagram stories. If you don't follow me on Instagram, go check it out. I don't know about you, but I love organizing and I think this is the most organized this closet has ever been and I've organized it tons of times. I finally told myself that I need to get rid of boxes and things that I don't need, clothes that I am not wearing anymore, things like that. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you wanna see more from me, make sure to subscribe and let me know what you guys like to do when organizing, what tips you like to use. I hope you find this video helpful and let's get into it. Okay, before we get started, make sure to light a candle and put on your favorite music. We want to have fun while we're doing this. So I love putting on the Indie Folk Chill playlist on Spotify. It's just like the perfect fall playlist. And now we are ready to get started. So the first thing I did was I just cleared out any unwanted clothing items or just things sitting in my closet that didn't need to be taking up space. Next thing I did was I just removed any empty hangers that didn't have any clothes on them and I put them aside for later if I wanted to rehang any items or change out the hanger color. Moving into shoes, I did the same thing here and just cleared out any shoes that I haven't worn in a while, shoes that are maybe beat up that I should really donate and get rid of, um, and just moved around everything to make sure that I can access what I like to wear on a daily basis. Once I removed everything from the top shelf of my closet, I had this big mess on the floor, but I knew what I wanted to do with everything, so that was a little bit comforting. But I had these storage bins originally from my college apartment, and I thought, why not reuse them instead of going out and buying new containers? I thought this would be a great way to contain the sheets and blankets that I had in my closet and make it easier to pull them out of my closet because every time I did, they would all fall on top of me. So I think this would really solve that issue while also keeping them contained and organized. Once the sheets were organized into their bins, I just organized all of my backpacks and travel bags, laptop cases, and kind of simulated what it would look like on the shelf. And then I put these bins on the shelf and also put my bags up there. And I realized that I didn't love that the bins were a little bit mismatched up there. And I had two matching bins on the lower shelves of my closet, so I switched them out. I had my athletic clothes and work clothes in these bins, so I just switched them and they looked really nice and matched because I'm going to see these on the top shelf whereas the other bins are kind of on the bottom shelf and harder to see. So I like that they're a little bit more organized and matchy-matchy. Matchy. 
Okay, next up, I tackled this huge box of empty boxes or huge pile of empty boxes. I like to save boxes for some reason. Um, some of these I kept because they were for my cameras, but I just organized them in a nice way in the back of my closet. You can't really see them, so they weren't really the focal point. Then I organized my clothes into color order and made sure that they were all hanging the right way. I just kind of fixed them, made sure nothing was falling over, and I know if you're OCD that these two black hangers are probably bothering you but I had to use them because these clothes like to slip off of the plastic hangers. Then I went to my floor and kind of cleared up all these things that I had pulled out of my closet in the first place. Things that I could put into storage bins downstairs, maybe they're sentimental or that I'm donating, giving away. <laughs> Okay, next up, I took all of my clothes off of the shelves and refolded them, just made them look a lot neater. I ended up putting my leggings into my dresser so I didn't put them back. I actually put this bin back with my socks and slippers and things like that because I have a lot of fuzzy socks and they didn't fit in my sock drawer. So kind of made my own little drawer in my closet and I kept my sweatpants there. The next shelf is all of my sweatshirts that I tried to do color order, but for the most part, I organize them in how much I wear them just because I don't wanna have to go to the bottom of the pile if I'm always wearing those shirts. I also refolded my jeans, which this probably has to happen maybe like twice every two months because they're always getting messy. I also like to pile them up in the amount that I wear each pair of jeans just so like I said it's kind of a tall pile so I can kind of reach at the top for the ones that I wear the most and then I put the bins back on the bottom shelf as you can see they're mismatched but all the clothes are going to be hiding this anyway. Last but not least, I organized all of my shoes, like I said in the beginning, in the way that I like to wear them, and I ended up getting rid of some, and I'll have to pull my fall boots and really get those out, because I still have some that aren't out. But this is the before, and stay tuned for the after. Mm -hmm. 